Good afternoon everybody. <clears throat> I want to do a quick video here about this portable dryer. I've seen a lot of these different portable dryers for sale on eBay on Walmart.com. Uh, but again, like with the washer videos I did, they never tell you the dimensions of the drum. So I'm gonna go ahead and give you that information. <clears throat> this is a 3.2 or a 3.5, I believe. It's a rep robe sun and of course it's digital these are the buttons that have like the metallic thing to touch them and it comes on um, this thing weighs about 60 pounds let me plug this in here show it to you so apparently these little LEDs inside that are purple and I got some socks in here are supposed to be UV UV LEDs to kill bacteria and stuff. But you've got your power button right here. And it makes that little tune. Plus start pause, preset, wrinkle guard, temperature, which is high, medium, and air. Time, which can go up to like two hours, I believe. And then you go anywhere from 30 minutes to 2 hours. And you have your smart setting and your bulky setting. Uh, one of the things I don't like about this, and I guess it doesn't really make a difference. Whenever it tumbles, it'll stop and it'll turn the other direction. It also only has two little fins in there to help tumble on the clothes instead of three. Which would be nice if it had three in it instead of two. Um, you have... This one says sterilization, cleaning, wrinkle guard, and lock. And then you did these three is your air, medium, and high buttons. Um, the dimensions of the drum on the inside is 22 inches wide and 13 inches from front to back. That's from, you know, just 13 inches this way. From front to back and uh, most of these little dryers like this they're good to use they use a lot of electricity this one's 1300 watts I believe um, they do have these little filters in the back you can get these filters on eBay 20 pack for like 10 bucks but you got your your plastic piece here then you got your lint filter and then that cloth one on the back that you replace and this thing just snaps into place so and then right down here on the other side is your uh heat that's where your uh heating coils are i don't know if you'll be able to see this but right down in this area right here is your heating coils right in there so uh contrary to belief these things do not dry close fast now, if you've got like socks like this in here, I've got about 10, 12 pairs of socks in there. 30 minutes is more than enough. The socks, whenever they're in a washer, they dry pretty quick just from spinning. So 30 minutes is more than enough. Um, there was a time I put like eight or nine bath towels in there. And those are like the 36 by 24 or 26, the big thick towels. It takes about two hours to dry eight or nine of those. Same way with jeans. If you have jeans, it's going to take about two hours for that. Uh, shirts probably take about an hour if it's just nothing but shirts. No, nothing really thick or heavy. But yeah, this thing is pretty cool. It does rock a little bit when it's uh, drying. So you have to put it on a, a sturdy surface. And the way I've got this set up is you, this comes with it, this little plastic piece here. This does not, this little pipe does not come with it. Neither does this. I had to buy that separate. But I took a piece of wood, I cut out a four inch hole, put this 90 degree in here, and I ran it from here to the back. So all that heat goes out the window and doesn't stay inside the, the apartment. So that is pretty much all of that. It does have four feet that are adjustable on the bottom, which you can't really see. I guess you can see one of them right there, the first two front ones. Um, the door has a plastic glass, which I don't like. I wish that was metal. 
It's kind of shaped like a bubble. Yeah, sort of flat on the front. Still have a little bit of a, a bubble on the front. There's more one on this side. But I think this is the air intake. It comes in through here, through those heating coils, and then it goes out the back there and then out that pipe, that dryer vent. So yeah, that's pretty much all it is. It's a standard plug. It's heavy duty cord, three prong. Uh, like I said, it's 1300 watts. It works, it does the job. It does take a while. It could take up to six hours, depending on how many clothes you gotta dry. But it usually takes between three and five with what I do here at the house. And it's got, it's got handles on both sides too. We carry it and then you can, the back of it is flat. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's flat all the way down. Except for that little piece right there that comes out. It screws on for the air. But that's pretty much how that goes. Um, this, again, is I think it's a 3.2. I'm 99% sure it's 3.2. Um, if you have any questions or comments, just let me know. I can uh, answer, answer your questions by email or in the description down or not the description but the comment box down below but let me know if you have any questions later guys